it's me again and I'm wearing my new top um, Holly's over there but she doesn't want to come in the video um, anyway I'm wearing my new top I thought it'd be very suitable to wear this top considering um, that I had the skin pulled up from my belly so how about this top isn't that cool oh yeah look at that isn't that a cool top oh yeah <laughs> I think I was wearing these trousers the other day anyway I'm going to do a little not really an update today but I'm going to do a little bit of a haul video um, because um, I've got some stuff today so anyway um, first thing I'm going to do is show you these Holly loves these don't you Holly she said mm-hmm uh, these are called Biore um, something. They're daily deep pour cleaning cloths. And I just took one out. Uh, apparently, there's this really handy little thing here that you open. And you pull it up and you open it. But when I bought, when I got them, I, I was, I didn't. Anyway, so uh, I opened them whichever way I fancied opening them, which was just ripping the whole thing away apart. So that's why it's in a Ziploc bag. But I'm going to show you how easy these things are. You take them out of the little baggie, then you go like this, and you take your glasses off, and you go like this. And look at that. You can take all your grit and grime and nastiness off your face with one cloth. This is, I don't think it's for makeup. Is it for makeup, Holly? I don't think it's makeup, but I do have a makeup. Holly, can you go to my bathroom and get me the makeup one that's right next to the sink? It's in a blue packet. Anyway, you just wash your face like this. This is for people who can't be bothered to wash their faces twice a day with... Um, oh, and can you bring me my... Th oh, on this side, the, the, uh, the pads that I use to clean my face. Anyway, so that cleans your face. It's my face. I haven't worn makeup in so long. Huh? Yes, and the and the and the round things that I use to clean my face, please. And because I don't wear, I haven't worn makeup for a while. I'm not, I'm not a big makeup wearer. Um, it's not particularly dirty, but here I'll just dispose of this. Um, yes, the disc, the jar. Um, but that's what I do to wash my face when I can't be bothered to wash my face. Just stick it on top of there, and the other one on top of there. And then I put on this stuff, which is called Skin Daily. It's called, um, it's a serum, niacinamide, 5% professional, blah, blah, blah. Anyway, I wear this, and again, I take my glasses off, put a little bit, just a tiny, one, one square of that stuff, and you put it on, and it is really good. I like it. It feels good. It doesn't smell disgusting. Actually, those wipes smell really nice. I like the smell of the wipes, don't you, Holly? Huh? The Bure ones. Holly loves the Bure um, strips that I get. Um, I've used them a couple of times, but this is something else we got. I get this monthly from Amazon, um, and it is one is called the Bure 14, and it's the deep cleansing pore strips. I use them maybe once a month, maybe not. That's mine. And this one's Holly's. Holly, I got you this one. This one has 24. It has the deep cleansing pore strips for the forehead and for the nose. Here, that's... I already put yours in your bathroom. Um, we get those from Amazon monthly on the save and subscribe. But this one's mine. Holly's just got the other one. This is Eh? Let's face it, what? What about it? I always love that quote. <laughs> Sometimes you just don't feel like washing your face. We get it. I get it, but anyway, this is how I get it. I get two boxes of these. <laughs> anyway, this is the one um, that Holly and I each get a box off, and then I get this one and she gets the other one. And you should see what's on the other one when she takes the strip off her nose. It's like a porcupine. -y. Anyway, this is the stuff I mentioned yesterday that I put on my hair after I wash it. Uh, it is the Frizzies John Frieda uh, Extra Strength Serum. I use 14 pumps put it in my hand, pump it in my hand like this, and then get so all my hair, go upside down and get all through my hair. And that is what I use before I put the HRCI spray on. So anyway, that's my spray. This is uh, something I haven't tried yet, but I will try it once I get back into the makeup routine. And this is from Neutrogena and it's the makeup 
um, remover, but this is not what I use. I usually use um, something that's a, wa a watery, oily thing or something. And this is what I use once a day to clean my skin. And that's one side is smooth and the other side has little, um, it's more abrasive and blah, blah, blah. Uh, so those are things that I got. Something else I got today was, oh, Holly, do you need some of these? Yeah. My arms are getting all flabby now. I haven't worked out for three weeks. Do you need some of these? I got a uh, four today. Mm. No? Um, I got these ones, which I love this one it smells i might have mentioned it it smells like the um what was it i said it smelled like ferrero rocher coconut chocolate things they oh this stuff is lovely i love it this one comes with a um pomegranate coconut and pear which is this one mango and pink grapefruit i don't think i tried the pink grapefruit <laughs> drop something i dropped this i haven't tried still um Oh, something else I got. Oh, Holly, do you need one of these? I got a spare one. I love this. This is um, the double extend um, uh, L'Oreal Paris. Oh, it, one side has the conditioner and the other side has the mascara. I love this. It really, it, it, I love it. I've been using it. That's my spare one and I got another one today for, with my subscribing save. Something else that I like that Holly hates is this. This is, uh, we use it, or I've used it on her for um, eyeshadow. Um, it's the sparkling powders. I got a set of these of six colors, and Holly doesn't like them because they get in her eyes. But anyway, a look at all these lovely, oops, Burt's Bees lip balms. I got a whole bunch of them yesterday. Um, they come in different scents. Peony, plum, and their colors as well. They're really cute. Strawberry, guava, um champagne i like champagne um but anyway yes that's something but this is my favorite uh, lip balm at the moment i used to really love these ones in fact they were my favorite for a long time many years but i really love this one and it smells so lovely okay so that's the lip balms that i've got uh today something else i got like i just mentioned was this do you need one did you say no? Okay. So that's a spare. And these two Burt's Bees, one was champagne and the other one was champagne. Wait a minute, I thought I was supposed to get four. I thought I had to check those boxes before Billy puts them out. And let's now check something else that we get on a monthly basis. These are called pop chips. These, the whole bag itself has a hundred calories only. Only this one comes in a variety of flavors. We've got barbecue and we've got sour cream and onion. And do we like these, Holly? Yeah. Did you hear that? Holly said yes. Anyway, they're really good. Um, it says all the flavor, half the fat, regular of uh, regular potato chips. They are a popped chip snack. I don't know how they make them, but anyway, that's that. And I got some other stuff. Oh, and I got something else. Holly has designed. A tattoo that she wants to put on the inside of her wrist so I got this pain relieving spray but also got this to use when I was using the laser I haven't used the laser since before my surgery so I don't know but this is Holly's wrist when she does her tattoo anyway so I thought today I would show you my belly button oh yay oh raise the roof raise the roof <laughs> okay I'm gonna show you my belly button this is okay I'm gonna show you something else right here you can tell in this light hold on in the shadow it feels like this bit here like when I was pregnant it feels like this is a limb it is right here if I bend down you can almost catch it in the light the shadow see so anyway it just feels really weird I'm gonna take these strips off When I put this over my boobs, it's like when he pulled the skin over my boobs. Still haven't got that picture yet from the um, plastic surgeon, Mr. Felody, Dr. Felody, whatever. I can't tell if it's skin or, or the, the tape. Holly, help. Hold on. Where's this tape? 
Am I taking the oil? Okay. Okay. Here we have it. I'm going to go really close and gross people out. Okay, I can, as you can tell, I have a ton of swelling. From the picture that I put as my thumbnail the other day, you could see I was quite unswollen, but look, I'm so swollen. The hips are really swollen, like here and here, oh, so swollen. But from the side, you can see how swollen. But anyway, look at my belly button. That is so gross. Ugh. Uh, Holly, can I have something to put over this? Because I don't want this. I put this on my belly button. Um, with please? the use of one of these things. Yes, please. Give me that. I'll just give me the whole thing. Um, anyway, I'm going to try the whole um, marble belly button training because I think my belly button's getting too. Before I put the cream, uh, the, the the ointment in today, it was really weird and dry looking. Um, and then uh, it looked kind of uh, yellowy, and like the, the it didn't look like a belly button. It looked like a kind of intestinal skin or something. Um, but anyway, that's what my belly button looks like. I'm putting massively long strips. And they're getting in my hair. Oh, cool. So, yeah, that's it. That's my belly button for today. But, yes, that's my tummy right now. And that's my intestines right now. <laughs> Holly's not amused. Would anybody like to see Holly? Holly, would you like to say hello? Oh, oh, bring that here. Bring that here. Oh, and Sean. Bring me Sean. Uh, Holly and I have been watching Sean the Sheep and we're getting so obsessed. You are getting so obsessed. <laughs> we're getting so obsessed. You barely watched an episode before you bought a cuddly animal. I bought, she says I barely watched an episode before I bought a cuddly animal. But yes, I was watching Back to the Future. I didn't buy any Doc um, Smith toys. Okay. Brown or whatever. <laughs> Smith, Brown, whatever. This is my Sean the Sheep. Isn't he cute? And he's got a little thingy-majiggy sucker thing to stick I was thinking of sticking him on my mirror but then I wouldn't be able to cuddle him at night he's my Sean the sheep then we've got Kevin no don't know if this is Kevin but he's been good for wedging underneath my belly a little bit not this side obviously um but this one I got two of these giant ones uh one for me and one for Holly then there's this this one's mine and this one's mine and then Holly's got the giant this guy Kevin I think this one's called Kevin and then she's got the little one with one eye. Okay. Bye, Sean. I want to get Timmy from Sean the Sheep, but they're not exactly uh, widely available right now. Um, and I think that's all for my haul for today. I've got an itch, and I've actually got certain areas of the front that I can actually feel. <laughs> I know. There are certain areas I can feel. Like, underneath... Oh, underneath my boobs I can feel... Um, one thing that happened as a result of my um, tummy tuck is that when he pulled down all the skin, the bottom, you know where the, if you're a woman you'd understand this, where there's the crease from your breast. And I've been wearing a bra to sleep for at least 15 years. No, probably about 10 years for a bra. Prior to that, it was a sports bra. And I've been, because uh, women who have larger breasts have to support them, at night and in fact most women should probably wear some support at night um i've been wearing a bra for a long time or a sports bra so that i don't end up having to tuck my breasts into my ankle socks when i'm older uh but when he pulled down the skin the crease underneath my breasts was pulled down and so now they're at least the the crease underneath has gone down at least an inch i'd say maybe me maybe more so i'm not really happy about that um, but I mean, what else was going to happen? Because he was pulling it down considerably because he took qu quite a thick wedge off. So anyway, not pleased about that. Don't know how that's going to factor in when I eventually get my breasts reduced. We'll see. Anyway, so that's it for today. Um, I'm breathing better. Um, I can walk up and down the stairs without having to hold a banister all the time. I can do it without getting out of breath. I can almost get out of bed without having to use my arms, but not quite yet. 
up, really sleep that comfortably on my left side. I'm sleeping better on my right. But I slept on my back last night for about six hours in one go and I woke up with tremendously bad backache. Oh, it took me ages to get out of bed because my back hurt so much. Um, that's about it, nothing else. Uh, still not able to eat a huge amount of food, like a normal sized meal. I'm still doing the little flatbreads. Um, I'm trying to eat, drink much more water. I'm trying to keep uh, taking my supplements, but I kind of forgot again. Um, but yeah, uh, that's it. So that's it for today. I hope uh, you have a good uh, evening and um, and uh, talk to you soon if I get some more stuff tomorrow. Oh, maybe my nail varnish is in the mailbox. <gasps> I have to do another one. Uh. Anyway, talk to you soon. Bye. Which size do you have? Let's stop.